Hello everyone. In this particular lecture, we are going to learn about that how to generate a list from an array dynamically with the help of JavaScript. Right. So let's start and see that how it can work. Right. So we are on our Visual Studio Code and on the index.html page. So we'll create a starting HTML in which I'm going to create an unordered list that is UL. Right. Inside of this, I will give a ID. ID as let's say my list right so we will create the list inside of this unordered list with the help of array right so let's uh, start the process in the javascript right so yeah, i'm writing inside the script tag so initially what we will write we will first create a array that is const items equals to let's let's say the array have apple right the banana and grapes and one more fruit that is uh, let's say mango right everyone's favorite mango fine now after that since the array is created now we will do that we will get the unordered list element that is this ul element for that we will write const list equals to document dot get element by id bracket inside of this will write my list like this right now coming forward and now what we'll do we will use a for each that is basically items right so whatever we have stored uh, inside the array that is items right so we'll put the for each loop on this so items dot for each and then bracket inside this will write item which will iterate over all the item present inside the array right and then a arrow and here the curly bracket right and inside of this will write const li equals to document dot create element bracket inside this will write li like this so const li equals document dot create element li so we have, we have created the list right now inside that list that is uh, basically li dot text content equals to item right so what is this uh, item okay let me check that whether it is right or not so yeah it is uh, almost correct fine yeah now coming forward let's let's do what that is list dot append child bracket and li right so yeah it is uh, fairly correct because every time it is creating a list inside of that list we are putting the element of the array that is at first it will iterate the apple and we'll put the element apple inside this list right and then we have appended this particular ally into the list list is what this unordered list got it yeah so this is how it, the whole functionality is now let's see that whether it is working or not so let's go to our website and you can see automatically our list got created that is apple banana grapes and mango right and if it was not present here if the JavaScript was not present here in that particular case what do you think will happen nothing it is completely black right yeah and after that after like putting the JavaScript you can see it is now having the list element. so this is how we can create the list using the array dynamically and this is all about today's video thank you so much for watching we will meet the next video very soon till then goodbye